like to return this movie. Okay, thank you. Come again. I can't believe you would rent this filth. It's not filth. It's basic instinct. Well, my husband was watching it, and there was a woman in there who showed her. <gasps> yes, she does. Come on. I mean, you don't see the whole thing. At most, you see a who. If you see the who, the hall's right there. Whatever it was, it's sinful. Why don't you pick out something else on the house? I don't know why you carry something like this. People like it. I've seen it three times. Do you really want to bring your baby into a world where this is considered entertainment? Lady, why don't you let me worry about my baby and uh, you worry about what your husband's watching? Maisie, she's still a customer. Not anymore. And I'm going to tell my prayer group not to come here either. <laughs> okay, you do that. We have family entertainment as well. Sound of music. No one shows nothing. Three times, really? I'm 17. I'm just so glad it's in the hands of a good Christian woman. Where are you headed here, Padre? <clears throat> well, some of my flock have concerns about the movies y'all rent. You know, the ones with the sexual content and whatnot. If they don't want to see whatnot, then they shouldn't rent whatnot. I hear you. God gave us free will. <laughs> but you're renting temptation. And you know who tempts us? The devil. So that's who's making me want to slam this door in your face. I'm just here to give you a heads up. People are upset, and I'd hate to see your business suffer. Are you threatening me? No, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, let me just take off my pastor hat, put on my neighbor cap, and start again. I'm going to put on my hat, too. It's got a big foam finger on top of it. Guess which one? The naughty one? Bingo. Two more copies of Basic Instinct and a couple more of Fatal Attraction. Is there anything else? Oh, uh, get a Last Temptation of Christ. That'll really piss people off. And a copy of The Last Temptation of Christ to really piss people off. Thank you. What are y'all doing? Well, I tried to be nice, but he kept pushing. Yeah, so now we're pushing back. Why do you care? Because I don't like anybody telling me how to run my business, especially him. This is not your business. That room back there with the shady piles of money, that's your business. Your secret illegal business. So, what, are we just supposed to become a Christian video store now? You know what? In this town, huh? No, I am not gonna let that man win. Hi, I'm with Channel 7 News. Can I help you? A local pastor has put together a petition of citizens concerned about the vulgar content of your video store. Would you care to comment? Damn straight I would. I want him to know. Here, no, give me that. Here. I want... I can assure you there's nothing immoral or indecent going on here. Wait a minute. You can see all the movies that Pastor Jeff ever rented? You can see any movie everyone's rented. Well, let's just see if he's as pious as he pretends to be. Let's find out. Ugh. Jesus Christ Superstar. Jesus of Nazareth, the blood of Jesus. Good Lord, how many Jesus movies are there? Oh, what about his wife? Oh, show me, show me. Hello, Pastor Jeff. Hey there, Connie. What brings you by? I just wanted to drop off a little gift. Dirty Dancing, I think you know how I feel about this movie. I do. I also know how your wife feels about it. What? She's rented it five times. That's a lot of shirtless Patrick Swayze. Must be some mistake. There isn't. Shall we talk about fatal attraction? Do we have to? Six times. Are you blackmailing me? Yeah. Well, it's not going to work. I'm a man of principles, and I stand by them. And I respect that. So let's talk about what your church elders are renting. Oh, come on. Want to know? Is it bad? It's Porky's bad. Oh. How are your principals feeling now? 